In your insurance news, American teens are struggling with growing waistlines. So much so, one in six American teens is overweight, and one in three is at risk. This according to a report by the National Center for Children in Poverty. And some more items to consider. Since the 1980s, the proportion of overweight children has steadily increased. Childhood obesity was found to be highest in the Southeast. In 2009, less than 20% of high school students engaged in the recommended 60 minutes of physical exercise every day. Also, teens eat more food away from home than in the past, and that means consuming more calories, including calories from saturated fat. Many teens are even too overweight to join the military, and too much time is being spent in front of the screen. That all said, the National Center for Children in Poverty is recommending several measures to fight teen obesity. Among them, increase access to healthy and affordable food, limit advertising of junk food aimed at young people, increase opportunities for young people to become physically active, and label food and menus clearly so parents know exactly what their kids are eating. The current generation of children could see shorter lifespans than their parents and be at greater risk for heart disease, diabetes, and cancer, among other things. And the obesity epidemic is costing the nation billions of dollars annually. For more details, check out our website or follow us on Twitter and see you later.